one Jaguar Land Rover battery, one AGM battery, they're both motorcycle batteries. Uh, Jaguar Land Rover in their wisdom have put uh, round uh, tree lugs on top of their battery and the one I've bought has got square so I need to convert the square ones to round ones so they'll basically fit the Range Rover. Uh, I love little problems so let's get it solved. Right, part of the problem solved, I've converted the square uh, tree lugs on top to round. Now it's interesting, Jaguar Land Rover, the battery is about 200 quid, all it is is a motorcycle battery. They're both AGMs, they're both 12 volts, they're both 200 amps. One of them is 50 quid and the other one is 20 quid. So it's worth converting, so that's what I've done at the moment. I've converted the top, but I need to make it fit uh, the negative and positive uh, on the car. So I've got a solution to that. So that's basically the two batteries, both the same size, they're both the same ampage. I've just got to make that uh, those lugs fit onto the uh, existing harness of the car. So that's part one. Part two, I've got an idea for the negative because the negative's a little bit too tight. Now what I want to do, before I put the negative on, is take the positive off to double check the negative is going to fit first time. I'm thinking I might have to open up the bracket because it's just, it is a good fit actually. Now, it's very important you do the negative at last. So always positive on first. Then you put the negative on. So we've done that bolt. Put the, and check we've got the negative positive, make sure the battery is in the right way. She's tight. Right now, we'll put the negative, uh, put the negative lead on. All right, just make sure that's done up. She's on. All right, the negative's on. So, always put the negative on very last. So when you're connecting the battery, positive on first. And obviously we're going to finish this up with some side clips on the positive. Yeah, they'll do. Nice and small. Feel them too big. Hate side clips, big ones. Smaller the better. Makes a nice little job. So this just makes it uh, in situ, makes it secure. Obviously when you do a battery, put a stamp on it as well, a date, so when you actually install it, which I've, uh, which I've done, so a little date stamp on the battery. Take these up, make them nice and nice tidy job better than what a garage would do because at least you're doing it all 
all yourself. Right, there's one battery in. That's done up. Positive, negative, they're nice and done. 12 volts. Tidy job.